So we're going to start playing with this swish. You can see the URL up here. It's, I think it's quite a cool little bit of uh, code. And we can do some simple, but that's about all I can do, uh, prologue with this. So that's an example. <coughs> John likes Mary, John likes Meg, David likes Mary, Mary likes David. They are facts. And then we've got this rules, prologue, it's back to front. If X likes Mary and X is a wildcard, any cap anything that starts with capital letters is a wildcard, then Mary likes X. So if somebody likes Mary, then Mary likes them. And then we've got Mary, Y. What this says is if Y likes Mary and, this is what the, the comma is, Mary likes Y, then Mary is in love with them. Okay, so we can do things like Does Mary like Meg? Okay. The answer is no. False here. We can ask a question with a wild card. Who does Mary like? Doesn't matter as long as it's a capital letter. And we get David. I'm going to click on next to see if there's anybody else. John. David again. Nobody else. We can go the other way. Who likes Mary? John does. David does. And then we're done. Now we can get a bit more interesting. Oh. Who does Mary love? Well, come to this, John, David, David again, and then nobody else. We can go the other way. Who is in love with Mary? Put the, it's important to put the full stops at the end, end of the statement. Nobody. Which raises an interesting question. Why? Now have a look at this line here. What that says is Mary likes Y, uh, sorry, loves Y, if Y likes Mary and Mary likes them. It doesn't say the other way around. So it doesn't say um, Z loves Mary 